going on guys, it's Matthew here with Gadget University and I'm here to show you today how to change your boot image when you first turn, up, turn on your phone. Uh, it's pretty simple, um, your phone does need to be rooted and your phone also needs to be in the resolution of 480 by 800. Uh, so first thing you're going to need to do is, uh, if you've rooted your phone already of course, then you are going to have the drivers installed. Uh, if not, you need to make sure that they are installed. For HTC phones with Windows 7, um, you're going to need to make sure you have HTC Sync installed. Uh, you can Google that. Um, it is version uh, 3.0. Now, I'm using a Mac with Parallels, but uh, it'll work only on uh, Windows XP and Windows 7 uh, computers. Now, first thing you're going to do is you're going to go on your phone and you're going to set your phone to debugging mode. And so what that's going to do is you're going to go down to Applications and then go to uh, development and check the box next to USB debugging. Once that has been checked, um, go ahead and go back to your home screen and you're pretty much good. Now, uh, next you need to make sure you have the file downloaded that I have included with this post. Um, go ahead and unzip it to anywhere you want to. I just left it in the same folder where I downloaded it at. It doesn't matter where you put it. Um, in these files, it, it actually has fastboot and ADB, so if you don't have the SDK from Android uh, downloaded, uh, don't worry. Now, next thing you need to do is you're going to need your boot image. Um, the boot image needs to be in the resolution of 480 by 800. So, uh, if you don't have like a Photoshop program or something like that, you're going to need to edit a, a file into that resolution, as well as it needs to be saved as a BMP file. Um, after it's been saved, you're going to drag it to this folder right here and you're going to name it flash excuse me splash s p l a s h and after that is done then you can start the program okay now it's going to let you know that the your phone needs to be in 480 by 800 go ahead and click on a key now this first process is going to convert your bmp file to an img file so that the phone can understand it and then flash the file so you're going to click on one that's already been done. Now it's going to say you need to have ADB and fastboot drivers installed. Now if you've already rooted your phone on this computer, then you should have those installed. If not, then you need to make sure that they are installed. Uh, the best way to do that would uh, be to go to um, manage and then go to, uh, you're going to see an option for uh, devices along the left hand side, device manager. Make sure there's no exclamation points on anything in this list. Um, once it, if it is, you need to right click on it. Um, for example, uh, let's go to, you need to right click on it and go to update device software. Uh, excuse me, update driver software. That's just in case it does not, you do not have your stuff installed properly. Now, um, back to the tutorial. Now you see, it's going to say you need to have it installed. We already do, so we're going to click on one. Then it's going to say, please exit all applications on your phone. Um, pretty much just get back to your home screen. That's all you really need to do. Press on any key. Now it's going to tell you to plug in your phone. So you're going to go ahead and do that. And press the key. If it does not show, give it a moment. And there you go. Your phone should now be booting into Fastboot. And go ahead and press the key once it's done. It says you, you should come to a white screen with a bunch of green text, which we already have. And go ahead and press the key. Then it's going to tell you that if you're in Fastboot, which we are, go ahead and continue. Now it's pushing the file to the phone. And once it's done, go ahead and press another key. Now your phone should reboot. And when it comes back up, you should see your boot image. And there it goes. GadgetU.net. Thank you guys for watching. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.